In this lesson, I want to show you how this search your courses works here. I briefly went over it before, but let me just go over it again just to make sure that you understand how it's supposed to work or how you can you know make changes to it. So what happens here is that whenever someone starts to search for a course that's in your um your section there, then it's going to automatically pull it up for them and then they can just, you know, click on it. So if they search for something that's not there, of course it's not going to put you know anything on it. And this is something that's really great to have because when people start to look for courses in your system then it can automatically pull it up for them. So the way that you, you know, check this here is you can go to the module manager and from the module manager, you want to go where it has uh, the, the section type, I'm sorry, the, the select type. And for the select type, you want to scroll down and you want to find uh, the course search. The SPLMS course search is going to, you know, bring this here and then you, you click on it. And then you can change the text that goes here. It says search your courses. You know, we can change it to search our courses or whatever it is that you want it to say. And then once you're done, there's nothing else that you have to do. You just click save and close. What's going to happen is that the system is going to search the courses that are in your database. And how that this was set up where you have this set up is you have to go to the page builder. And remember that the page builder had played such a major role in creating this site. So from the page builder, when you go to the home, a uh, home section here, you're going to be able to see how this is connected. And what they did here is they added a new add-on and they connected a Joomla module through SP Page Builder. So let me show you what I'm talking about here. So you want to click on where it says Joomla module, you click on this this pencil icon there and you scroll down when you, where you see it says select module from here you can select all the active modules on your website so if there's something that you want to you want to show for example if you wanted to show a tag cloud or if you wanted to show event categories whatever it is that you want to show when you make that selection then it's going to pull it from that module and connect it with the page so this one right now have been set up to connect the search part um, and incorporate it into the, the site. So that's something that's very, very cool. And then when someone is looking for something, the moment that they type, you know, I'm looking for a web development. And as I type it in, it's going to give me all the courses that have the word web in it. And then uh, if, if something that I'm, I find it, then I can just click on it and it can take me to that page. So it takes, you know, it took me right to the web development page. So this is really great whether you have just, you know, a few courses or if you have, you know, a, a ton of courses. So this is something that is really great to have.